Welcome back to TWE 2016. I'm here once again with my 2016 WWE save. We are here on the SmackDown. Um, second to last SmackDown before No Way Out. Well, let's get going. We have qu a couple of pre-show matches. First one, Rey Mysterio, Simon Gotch. I didn't expect this one to do as good as it did. Alright, good job Simon Gotch. Mainly Rey Mysterio, but good job Simon Gotch, I guess, still. Alright, match. I expected this about to be in this range. Alberto Del Rio defeats Apollo Crews. All right, style and substance defeats, defeats Fandango and Justin Gabriel. Nah, I expected worse. Good, good job, style and substance. Who I will blame everything on. For that's good on, mainly Tyler Breeze, but good job the rest of you guys do. I expected this to do a little bit better, but no, that's all right. Oh well, Neville loses to Randy Orton. All right, I think this leads into the regular show. Yep. Shane McMahon starts on SmackDown. Shane says, due to his actions last week, Sami Zayn has been suspended indefinitely because he interfered in the main event last week. Bobby Roode's music hits and he comes out to the stage. Shane, I know what I said last week, but I don't want to. But I want to destroy Sami Zayn in the ring at No Way Out. And Shane says, very admirable of you, admirable of you, Bobby. So now we know how long Sami is suspended, and at, as he will face you at No Way Out. Rude thanks Shane and said, and then Shane says, "Hey Bobby, how about you take the night off? Also, tonight, Randy Orton, if you get involved in tonight's main event of Seth Rollins and versus Dean Ambrose, you'll be out of the title match, not this Sunday, but at No Way Out. At No Way Out. All right. Good promo by Charlotte. She says." Mass and the only reason you are in this match is because, for whatever reason, this month Shane McMahon is triple threat happy. But that doesn't change the fact you don't deserve to be there, and you will fall. So, I don't know. A pretty good match. Um, Becky Lynch defeated Maria... Uh, wait, who did Becky pin? Oh, it was elimination, technically. Oh, well. Good match. Becky and Maria win. Charlie Alexa Brillis didn't work well. Madison is getting better at her gimmick. Alexa was off her game. Oh well. And Madison cuts a good promo. Hey Charlotte, I deserve to be here because I beat Becky when was the last time you beat you did that without the help of a briefcase, huh? And as for you, Becky, I beat you once and I'll beat you again. So a good promo there by Madison. Good job, Madison. All right. Tyler Breeze cuts a good promo as he always does. Next, my next, my next challenge for my U.S. title is in action, and Joe, I'll be watching and I'll be mmm gorgeous while watching. Good, good job, Tyler Breeze. Samoa Joe defeats Jay Lee the Lukokina Clutch after distraction from Jericho, so Jericho cut, does a distraction, which allows Joe to lock in the Kokina Clutch. Good, good. All right, Jericho cuts a promo after the match. I meant for Jay Lethal to be in the fr in on this, but whatever. Jericho says, "You stupid idiot! No way out! I will destroy you and make you my personal assistant, so I can teach you the ways of Jericho." I forgot about that stipulation. But I reminded myself because I watched a, a past video of mine, so I'm like, oh yeah, that was the stipulation for match, wasn't it? Anyway, let's continue on. Ray cuts a promo. Alberto, you and me have been fighting ever since you started here in the WWE, and since we both, and since we have both left and came back, and we still hate each other to this day. And I'm not going to fool myself into thinking no way out is the end of end of it either, but in the middle of the promo, Alberto Lurio attacks Rey Mysterio from behind and beats him down. Eh. Alright. I expected about this for this match, triple threat match. Cody Rose defeated Blake and Mer Big Sh Blake and Big Show whenever Cody defeated Big Show with a crossroads. Blake was the weak link, but hey, gotta put him in there so he can learn. Alright, Randy Orton cuts a promo. It doesn't matter who walks out the victor tonight. Because I'm going to be the WWE Champion after No Way Out. And that is all that matters. Alright. Seth Rollins comes out makes an elaborate entrance. They're making big entrances. This is a big match. Big fight feel. Ambrose makes the same. 
Oh, good match. Okay. An exceptional match. Seth Rollins defeated Dean Ambrose by pinfall with a curb stomp. Clean. He beats him clean. Good match, man. What was the negatives? I mean, also, they... I mean, they were holding back because it was only a SmackDown. Imagine what they could do on a pay-per-view one-on-one. Whew. But after the match, Randy Orton attacks Seth Rollins. But then after that, he attacks Dean Ambrose. Let's officially... How many segments? It's ten. Uh, I think that should be good. Complete success heel turn for Randy Orton. And the show, it gets an 84. Great main event. Great main event. Not the best match I've ever done, but I think if that match is on pay-per-view, I think that match becomes the best match that I've ever put on. Alrighty. Come on, load, load, load. I got some more people signing. Got some, I got a Rey Mysterio incident. It's, oh no. He... How come I can't sending the worker to rehab has a high p probability of getting him to improve his behavior? Uh, why can't I send him to rehab? Whatever. I can play off as the I can I can play off on television. Ray got hurt by the the um, yeah. I bet you are Ray. Billy Kidman, fuck off. Jericho, fuck off. Guys, guys, guys. He failed the drug test. I'm giving him money so he won't. He's just always happy. Be happy, Ray. You failed a drug test. What am I else am I supposed to do? Is anyone else mad about that? Big show. Come on. Fuck off. Is anyone notably a oh, burrow? Oh, yeah. He's been angry. Ray. Seamus. Seamus is the odd one out here. Alright. Let's see here. Paulo Cruz, yeah, I like him too, Alberto. I just don't know where to put him in yet. All right, no mercy. Next episode, Raw's pay-per-view. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.